what kind of advice and word do you have to younger leaders, especially in state environmental issues? Get educated. I just finished a couple of days on Lake Tocopelago with the most marvelous students from the University of Florida who were working on snail cuts. I just finished uh, meetings on the C-111 basin in, in South Dade. Um, I, I meet with students, I hope, several times a year at the universities and quite more frequently at high schools and, and prep schools. You will not be effective unless you are well-trained, which means educated, and the next century, this century, all good decision making is going to be based on sound science. Where I won some with tremendous emotion and manipulation of the press or of the issue, those days are gone. There's going to be still a lot of emotionalism and environmentalism because we're talking about Mother Earth and our position on Mother Earth. But to win now, you've got to be well trained and you've got to be sound scientifically or at least know where to get sound science. And to every young person who ever sees this, go for it. It's, it's, the, it's the one mainstream of your life that approaching 75 you'll say, I really enjoyed the battle.